and run through it. Okay, so uh, first you've got sit-ups. I'll quickly run through the exercises. Okay, so sit-ups. Touch the floor, touch the toes. If you're modifying it, you can do knee slides. So you're just sliding the pants up onto the knees. The floor press is going to be your two dumbbells. Or if you're using water bottle. Say that again. I can't see you. Oh, I've just seen that now. It's tilted a bit for you. Is that better? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Okay. Yeah, perfect. Sorry. Yeah, so floor press second. That's just going to be pressing straight up over the head. Use your water bottles or dumbbells for that one. Then you're onto hollow rocks. Drag those heels down. Then we're onto a bent over rope, which is for your back. Two dumbbells. Pull straight up. Then you're onto a curl and press. Okay. Don't know how I'm going to get on with these weights for 40 seconds, but we'll try them. Mountain climber is this. Okay, knees in on the body. Shoulders and hips level. Then we're onto tricep kickbacks. So that's one arm. Your elbows bent. And you straighten it up. Bring it above your back. 20 seconds off each arm. Then you're onto a kettlebell swing. Snapping the hips, and you're finishing with a plank with your shoulders and hips level, squeezing the core. Okay, I'm going to get our timer on here. Should be all, we should all be good to go there at home. And if you're doing this later on, make sure you've got your equipment ready now or just pause the video. Okay, go in 10 seconds. First one is sit up, so we're on the floor for that. Off we go. So we're straight through for the next 18 minutes without a break. We're set all the way to the top on the sit ups. Floor press straight away. Straight up. Two dumbbells in line with your chest. Exhale and inhale on the way down. So you're breathing out through the nose. Sorry, breathing out through the mouth on the way up, in through the nose on the way down. It's better if you can do this with a nice bit of resistance at home. So the 3 kg dumbbells will work fine. You probably would manage 5 kg or more if you have them, or if you have an alternative that's a little bit heavier, just for this exercise. Okay, follow the rocks, we're staying on the ground, no equipment now, we're just driving the heels down, and we're coming up. Keep the arms overhead, so it's for the tummy. That's it, drive the heels right down. Arms staying over the head. Okay, we're working the back this time, bent over roll. Two weights. So go a little hinge on the hips. Elbows coming above the back. Twenty seconds to go. Okay. Curl and press. Curl the arms, press overhead. Try and do it neither. Stanford. Fifteen seconds to go. Try 
Start to swing the weights forward. Okay. Mountain climbers. Into the body. Shoulders and hips level. So each round we do is going to be six minutes long. We're doing three rounds. Swing the weight. I'll tell you which change sides. Okay, opposite side. So it's bent, then it's straight. Then it's coming above the back. Okay, get the butt swings are next. Snap the hips. Looking straight ahead. Arms are staying straight. one in round one. Good work guys, let's keep it going now. Shoulders and hips level. Don't arch your back low. Don't have your bum up in the air. Just nice and controlled. Just hold in that position. Shoulders and hips settle. Okay, we're back on sit-ups. This is round two. Start straight away. When we get to round three, we're going to be counting the reps. But this round again, you're just concentrating on your technique, getting it right for round three, and then we can pick up the pace there on round three. Touching the toes, just over the head each time. Okay, floor press next. So we're pressing straight up. Get around the chest. Bend the knees on this one. Make sure the dumbbells are in line with the chest and not up on the shoulders or higher. Arms straight out, just make sure you don't fully lock out the joints. Okay, we're on to hollow rocks next. Drive the heels down, keep the arms overhead. The arms up over the head, drive the heels towards the floor. Okay, then over row. Two weights, work in the back this time. Elbow 
elbow should be coming above the back. 20 seconds to go. Okay, curl and press. Good work guys, 20 seconds to go. Level. Squeeze that tummy as you're doing it. Get those knees in under the body. Try to kick back. Start straight away. Back parallel to the floor. Bend the arm and then straighten it. Try not to do a swing in motion. Just do it slowly. the opposite side. the side for any practicing later on. Straight arms, don't bend the elbows. Good work guys, 20 seconds to go. Sit-ups, pick up the pace, just continue your count on for each exercise. I'm on 52 at the minute.
Okay, I'm on 79. Bent over roll. Continue down. Get that elbow above the back. Okay, I'm on 114. I won't be getting through too many of the curling press, I think. Okay, keep going, guys. Okay, I'm on one, two, seven. Back to Cyprus next. Two nineteen, press up kickbacks. Okay, off the side. Okay, 243, get the bell swings. Okay, I'm on 273. Plank, guys. You don't need to count the plank. Just keep your score now. So just hold it there as the last one. We'll grab some water after this. Shoulders and hips level. Since that tummy, nice strong core. When we finish this, we run through our scores, take two minutes break, and then a six minute finisher of core as well. Hold that position. Don't have your bum in the air. Don't arch too low. Shoulders, hips level. Okay. Come on, guys. Well done. Thought I'd miscounted there, but. Okay, we'll just have a quick look, see how everyone got on. Grab your water. Um, Rosaline, how'd you get on there? 259. Brilliant. What did you find the hardest? <laughs> Everything. <laughs> the um, hollow rocks, I don't like those in my bed. But... Yeah. No, but I, yeah, personally, I'd go hollow rocks as well. Um, just, uh, I didn't have my lighter or dumbbells tonight, so the curling press was definitely the worst for me. Cathy? Brilliant, really, really good. Um, anything you struggled with, or were they all? I, I was kind of fixed when I came out of the 
Chris. But do you have fours or fives, is it? I have four, I have fours. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Like on those on those ones where once you start pushing something over your head, yeah. if it's over three, three, four kg, it is challenging. Marie? Two forty nine. Brilliant. You look tired. <laughs> you just like okay. take a deep breath. What one was the, the worst or were they just all bad? I didn't like that brooks either. I find that hard on my back. Yeah, it's it's uh it can catch as you're coming back up to be fair. Yeah. Um I was discuss yeah, I was discussing that with one of the girls in the other group as well. You know, if for any reason though any if any of the exercise of that is catching you on your back or your hips or anything, just modify it. Go with something you're comfortable with, like a knee slide or something that's a little bit easier. Because the hollow rocks is the hardest of the hard. Like that, bicycle crunch and V-sits would be the toughest. Or else an iron butterfly yeah. was sitting up. Uh, Eva? Uh, 252. Brilliant. Uh, so you're, is it fives you have, or fives or six? It's fives. I found as well the pepper swing and slow mix at 10 kg. Yeah. Heavier kettlebell, yeah. Because, yeah. Uh, yeah, I... I only had the heavy kettlebell for the last round, but we were counting the last round, so that wasn't too bad. But the kettlebell makes a huge difference. If you're on a 6 kg on that, it's, it's not challenging at all. You need to have the 8 or the 10 really. Yeah. Okay. Um, what I'll do is so, you grab your water. I'm just going to run through the exercises for, for you guys and for the people doing this later, so I can cut off the recording so it uploads faster. So we've got uh, two, four, six exercises. Okay, so you've got your press up first. This is going to be for 30 seconds. Chest to the floor, or you can modify off the knees. Okay. Then your second one's going to be your side plank. So you're keeping a straight line. I'll show you from the sides. Don't let your hips slump to the floor. You're holding that for 30 seconds as well. So press ups for 30 seconds, side plank for 30 seconds. Then turn over to the opposite side, side plank for 30 seconds. Then you grab your water bottle, your bag, whatever you're using, kettlebell, for your Russian twists across the body. Do these slowly, it's more beneficial if you take your time. Then I want you to do sliders. We've done these last week twice. You're aiming for the ankles, I'll show you from the sides. Okay? Yeah, you need to tilt the camera. Tilt it again, sorry. <laughs> <One sec. laughs> Here we go. Yeah. Now we've probably tilted it too much. <laughs> okay, I'll show you anyway. Okay, here's the sliders. Okay, and then we have tricep dips. You can go straight leg or you can go bent knee. Use a chair, a couch, whatever's nearby. If you don't have either, go for your tricep extension overhead. Okay, I'm gonna turn off this camera now. So those six exercises, 30 seconds each, do two rounds, and that'll be your workout done.